Hey guys, tonight we had impact. Oh, there's something on my screen. Tonight we had impact, and I was completely reminded of why I love impact so much. If you guys can deal with this horrible shot. Oh my gosh, I just got a ton of bank stuff in the mail. That is always a fun time. I love bank stuff. Who doesn't? Um, anyways. Okay, this is what I got to round off the night. Um, these are officially from Student Ministries, um, or something like that. I got them from Student Ministries Child, so, obviously. Um, but yeah, oh my gosh. She just came up to me, she's like, Hey, we have extras, anyone want some bread? I'm like, I'll take it. I took one roll, it was a Hawaiian, I think a Hawaiian roll. She's like, oh, you don't want the other one? Okay, I'm like, alright, fine, I'll take the other one. And I'm like, sweet. And then she comes out 30 seconds later with a whole bunch of Oreos. I'm like, what, you get Oreos? She's like, oh no, you want them? Take them all, we don't want them. <laughs> I'm almost like, oh my. So, that was fun times, y'all. Um, chocolate Oreos. Let's see, I know... I don't really know how many. Alright, looks like they they kind of ate out the first little, the, you know, there's three things. They ate out the middle, but the side columns are completely full of Oreos. These are chocolate filled Oreos. Chocolate filled Oreos are the best Oreos other than the one. I mean, honestly, they are so good. I They're debatably the best Oreos ever. Um, they're so good. Um, and birthday cake is up there too, but I think chocolate is better. Mmm. I already have this entire plate thing full of Oreos, so I don't even need more Oreos. But you know what? I got some and I ain't complaining. I'm gonna take those to school tomorrow and give some away. I think they're already open, so they might go bad soon. And you know what? Everyone needs a little given. If these were given to me, might as well give them out. Plus, people wanted Oreos and I told them they weren't open, so I wasn't gonna give them out. And then in the car, I realized they were open, so tomorrow I'm going to give them out. Hook some people up with some Oreos. Who doesn't want to be hooked up with some Oreos? I mean, Oreos are so good. Mmm. Ow! That was painful. Uh-uh. I cried. Alright, so. Alright, I'll promise I'll be done for this, okay? Let me just finish this. Um, so that was a really fun thing. That was my thought train in starting this vlog. It's 9.26 on a Wednesday. So, and box over. I have school tomorrow. Ooh, I need to get the name tag. Um, I have school tomorrow um, that I have to go to. So, I need to um, go to bed soon. Like, really soon, actually. Um, and go do schools and like <laughs> I have to do that thing where you like you know you sleep and then you get some rest um I don't know if you guys do that at your house but um yeah I kind of sleep so yeah I have to do that before I go to school tomorrow good idea right um and then let's see tomorrow I don't think I have any other tests this week um generally speaking I don't have any more to Tomorrow we are doing a mock trial in English, which is going to be interesting. Um, I have a very minor role, so not too big of a deal for me, but um, it is going to be very, very interesting. My seat partner, um, if anyone still uses that term, is the person getting prosecuted for shooting someone. So that's going to be interesting. Um, I'm just barely related. Um, I barely know him and barely know the person he shot so um doing of mice and men if you guys have read that book we're doing a trial for that um which is going to be interesting i'm the boss um so let's see that is going on tomorrow biology tomorrow shoot i did not look at the schedule for what we are doing in bio tomorrow tomorrow is thursday right because today's wednesday so nothing is due tomorrow i just wow homework is so sparse this week you would think leading up to finals i'd be stressed out but i mean we are really are not doing that much in school right now um in math we have this packet to do but number one, it's a really easy packet. And number two, we have time every day in class to work on it. So like, 
I just did a ton of work today and it's not due till like next week so it's like wow I'm just gonna finish so much um I'm gonna be like practically done um I did my Spanish home and then I did my Spanish homework at school like I said that freshman event um where we eat cookies cookies weren't as good today but still very good um hot chocolate um and then I did my English whoa I was originally I was just gonna do like a small voice crack on purpose but then it just went whew, just like whew. I was gonna go for this and it went whew, like through the roof like whoa bar breaking Whee! <laughs> okay I need to people are asleep people are asleep um or at least trying to go to bed until I decided to scream um Anyways, so is it a, is it kind of weird to have a dead elf in the car? He's not dead, by the way. He still has his magic. I mean, I don't think his magic comes back till December, right? Like, is that how it works? Anyways, I don't think he's dead, but he definitely, he's like in deep sleep and like, he's looking at me. This is actually really weird. He's like, I can't find a... Why is it wet? Why is his name tag wet? It's not wet down here. Well, that's odd. Alright, um, anyways, this is one of those vlogs that I didn't really have a train of thought to go off of. Um, I was just trying to make a video, honestly, before I went to bed because we had impact tonight. Um, so, I want to make a video, but at the same time... Yeah, at the same time, um, I just kind of want to go to bed, so it's like, I'm not going to plan, I'm just going to kind of hit the record. Tomorrow, hopefully, will be a better video, although I have plenty of stuff and things to do tomorrow, um, like, I don't know, all of the stuff and things. I have school, I think, can't recall, but I'm pretty sure I had a lot of homework. There's no bio homework. I have, yeah, I'm going to have to write a paper for English tomorrow night. Um, about the trial and it's due Friday so that's yeah definitely considerably possibly a load of homework um, and then there'll be some Spanish and I'm gonna tell you guys right now I'm not doing any math homework tomorrow night if I'm writing a paper I don't know maybe I will we'll see how it goes down and I don't know if I'm gonna go in tomorrow either because Lucas cannot go in tomorrow so first of all I'd be alone um, although my other friend might come um, but I, you can't, I'm can't, not going to be able to write a paper while I'm at the thing, like at school. I need to come home and get on the computer. I'm going to write that paper. So, yeah. Anyways, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Um, if we could talk about Mammoth for a moment, because Mammoth is... I mean, it happened a while ago for you guys, but Mammoth is basically literally sitting in heaven right now. The gates of heaven have opened up at 11,053 feet, and outpouring from heaven is the most glorious thing ever. It is snow, and it is all falling at Mammoth at heaven's perfect timing. Um, basically, MLK weekend is this weekend um, for me, and Mammoth just got last time i checked 15 feet of snow and it's literally supposed to snow s supposed supposed to snow all the way through friday like snowing the day friday saturday it's gonna be cloudy or sunny again the day mlk weekend so many people are gonna be there shredding 15 feet of fresh snow the base at the summit is 230 inches they get 10 more inches in the next two days that it's going to be snowing, which should not be a difficult task. Their base will be 240, which is a lot easier for math to calculate that they will have 20 flipping feet of snow just sitting there for the sun to shine and have MLK weekend and just have, they have the most snow out of any resort in the entire country. Right now, if you have 230 inches, that's um, 2.2. I mean, 19.16 feet, um, 19 and a 6 feet, f foot, feet, feet, not feet, um, but man, if we can just get, um, 10 more inches of snow, which should be so easy compared to, man, they've just got 15 feet, 10 inches, that's all we're asking for for the next two days that it's supposed to snow all day, both days, um, we will have 
20 feet of snow. We already have the most snow of any resort in the entire country right now. Um, but man, Mammoth is just living it up. MLK weekend, then another weekend, and then we're going. So, unless it all of a sudden we global warming just hits, like China just like lets out so much gas and ozone effect, and then all of a sudden it goes up to 100 degrees and everything melts. At that point, Mammoth will be the least of our worries, but um, unless something insane happens, I'm gonna, we're going to be skiing on 20 feet of snow, which is so good. At the same time, it's not that good because 20 feet of fresh snow means that people might want to go to Mammoth too. Other people that weren't planning on going, so we might have some more friends there. And if you guys ski, you know that <laughs> they're really not friends, they're just other people to take up space in the line, make the line longer, um, and steal all your fresh snow. There will not be any powder unless another storm comes in right before we go, but there is always the possibility, um, uh, but they're not possibility, but people will always steal your groom. Don't let people steal your groom, especially brides. That, I mean, that, I mean, I guess that sentence makes sense. Anyways, don't let people steal your groom. Those snow cats get out there, they groom it, they're grooming it just for you. You get there right when the mountain opens, and you get all that groom. Okay, you hear me? You go skiing. Anyways, I hope you all enjoy the video. If you like the video, leave a like. If you dislike the video, leave a dislike. I'm going to share your opinion in the comment section down below. And I'll see you next time, guys. Bye, bye, bye.